about a game. It's a red skin. Hey guys. guys, today we're going to be doing a Q&A. My name is Kai. And my name is Jenny, and I'll be asking the first question. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Have you ever met someone famous? Mm -hmm. I haven't met, but I've seen. Who? I've been to a lot of concerts, I don't know. Um, people I do remember is uh, Billy. Mm -hmm. uh, her, mm -hmm. mm, Maluma, mm -hmm. and those are the only ones I remember at the top of my head. You're forgetting one. Am I? You're just too small. Oh, the crazy thing is, I got to see him before he died. Have you ever met someone famous? Mm -mm. <laughs> no, but I have seen. Billy, her, well, the same thing as you, Billy, her, Maluma, I've seen Carrie Underwood. Mm. What's the one you went to with grandma? <gasps> Paula Abdin. Or, uh, no, Abdul. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm messing up the name. Hey. That one was fun, dude. Yeah. So the next question is, what's at the top of your bucket list? Making that money. Making that money. I'm just kidding. That's on your bucket list? Yes, always. That's it? No, I'm gonna travel. Where to? Mm, to the Bahamas, to Cancun, to Bora Bora, to Dubai, anywhere. Yeah? Yeah, I wanna travel everywhere. I wanna go to Paris. I wanna go to Iceland. I wanna go everywhere. I wanna go across the whole world. Where did you and your best friend meet? I don't have one. <laughs> <laughs> we don't got this one. She's my best friend. Well, I met you on Facebook. <laughs> How'd you meet me? Well, that was not the question, but um, you added me on no on Snap. What the oh, hell? Snap. What did he say? <laughs> oh. Damn. You know, back then when, like, Facebook, like, actually told you how to message with us? Yeah. I think, I think you sent me a message, like, right after. Yeah. And then I was, like, looking through your, through your profile. <laughs> and I was like, she looks like somebody I know. I was like, but that person was annoying. Mm -hmm. But then I was like, I don't think it is. So, like, I accepted it, and then I messaged you back. And, yeah. Yeah. That's. That's how I met my best friend. Yeah. Okay. Would you like to be famous? Mm, maybe not famous famous, but maybe like known. Known? Yeah. Known not, like, not like, known, like, known like what? Like as what? Like, like what would be your... Like, oh, hey, that's Jenny and Kai. Not like I freaking step out of my house and like freaking paparazzi's there type of thing. You know? It's just like, oh, I know them. Mm -hmm. Like, you know? Like TikTokers or... Stuff like that. And me on TikTok. <laughs> um, here you go. You can ask the next one. Okay. And you, would you like to be famous? I wouldn't like to be famous. Like you said, I would... I wouldn't even want to like be known. Like, yeah, I want to have. I don't know how to say. It. I don't know. You just want to be known, right? Yeah, like I, I like she said. I don't want paparazzi like being at my house. Like, I know, I know some people, some YouTubers, they be having like stalkers and shit. But that's different. <laughs> I don't want paparazzi to be like. <laughs> Right. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, I just woke up. Chill. God damn, chill. 
We all humans here. What's your favorite song at the moment? Um, my favorite Literally. song is Ya Superame. What's your favorite song? My favorite song is Jugaste y Sufri. Jugaste y Sufri. Yeah, I have that. I have that on replay like all day. What's your zodiac sign? Um, I'm an Aquarius. You can see right there. Right, right there. That means Aquarius. What's your sign? <laughs> I'm a Capricorn. Nobody likes us, but it's okay because we don't like you guys. <laughs> What's your favorite color? Damn. I got a lot of favorite colors. As you can see, I'm wearing them right now. Blue, white, black. You like red? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. I told you that. The, day, the night that we were talking in bed about our favorite colors, I told you, oh, I like red. And you were like, really? And I was like, yes. <laughs> really? Yes. <Yeah. laughs> she forgets. It's okay. What's your dream car? Um... It was a Honda Accord. Oh no, dude, I'm tripping. It's a GMC, Sierra. No. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. The truck. She wants. Dude, a truck. I was over here thinking about like an actual car. No, I want a GMC Sierra. Okay. She a truck girl. Mm -hmm. I just want an SRT. I don't care if there's newer ones. That's the one I want. Yeah. And what I want it, it I wanna build it and make it a white body. Mm. What color? It I'm sorry, I know you don't like that fucking color. But it's like that matte green. Like it's I like, like a dark that one. one. You know which I'm talking about? Yeah. When do y'all plan to have kids? And if so, what do you guys want first? A boy or a girl? Hmm. Well, we're stable. Mentally, emotionally, financially, physically, physically. The next question is going to be, when was your most embarrassing moment? <laughs> okay, so, I don't know, I don't know if everybody ran the lab, like in elementary, but you know how you run the lab in PE in high school, right? Mm-hmm. So, but our school, we would only run a mile, like, like in elementary school, you go by grades, right? Like, oh, kindergarten has lunch at this and this time, you know, and so on. So, the whole fifth grade, we got in trouble, because they would make us, like, sit, like, sit down, like, on the fucking concrete. Sit down before we went into the, into the cafeteria, right? And we weren't listening. Because they stand you up and they let that class go. And then the next one, you know. So we ran the mile. And there was a there was a dead bird. <laughs> there was a dead bird? Yeah, like on the side, like just dead, chilling. <laughs> <laughs> and my friends, they're like, ew, you got to spit. And they're like, because... um. If you don't spit, it's bad luck. I was like, I'm not gonna spit, that's gross. And they all spit. So we were running, and then while we were running, we were playing this one game. And then it was like, it was like a dip. Or like, what is it? It's a dip, huh? It was a dip. And we would like jump over it. And then <laughs> they all jumped over it. And then my dumbass, when it was my turn, I tried to jump over it, and then, like, I tripped, and everybody seen it, dude, everybody, because we were, like, in the middle, mm -hmm. so everybody seen it, and the teacher was just, like, looking at me, she's like, somebody pick her up, and I was looking at her, like, really, you can't help me, oh, hell like, no. she was literally screaming, she was, like, literally walking, she's like, somebody pick her up, oh, my God, dude. that was embarrassing, and I will never forget that. Everybody else probably did, but I will not. <laughs> <laughs> My most embarrassing moment. <laughs> what? It was when I first farted in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> she's 
She was so mad. I don't know how it happened, but I ended up falling. I was laughing so hard, okay? And then I ended up falling, and I fucking... I farted. We were laughing, and you threw like, yourself on the floor. Like, <laughs> I was you... laughing hard. Like, we were laughing hard. All I remember is laughing so, so hard, and... Yeah, I probably laughed the fart out of me. You did. You were like, get out. I'm like, dude, it's so normal. I was so mad. Like, it was the first time. After that, you were just a loose cannon. <laughs> hey, Abby, I'll be throwing trumpets in here. <laughs> What's your body count? <laughs> I'm a child of God. <laughs> yeah? What's yours? This ain't answer or drink. She got a count. I guess Her one. fingers and toes. I don't know, I can't do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What is that? What is that? <laughs> All right. What happened when you experienced your drunkest moment? It wasn't the day of, but it was like literally the next day. I was working at Ross and you were still going to school. <laughs> and I literally started my shift and like, Two, three hours, and I called, and I was like, I can't make it, dude. You were I so hungover. I couldn't eat. I couldn't. I freaking couldn't drink nothing. And I was using the bathroom. Oh, my God, dude. Every, like, 10 seconds, I was throwing up, and it was, like, big. I literally had to hold, like, the trash can in front of me and, like, just throw it all up. <sighs> it was a night that I took, like, 20 shots. Of like three different alcohols. She could have died. Never again. She could have died. That night was fun though. The next morning. <laughs> <laughs> it was not. My most drunkest moment. Honestly, honest to God. Is the time me and you drank two bottles of Patron by ourselves. <sighs> Dude, that was so bad. It all started off with us vibing to music, you know. We were swinging and we, we loved to like. We were swinging and drinking and we were taking shots, mm -hmm. nothing but shots. After a couple of shots with a chaser, after then we just started taking shots, yeah. shots with, and we just were like using salt and lime, you know. And we were just swinging back and forth. And out of nowhere, I swing this way, and the kitchen sink is, like, literally right there onto my side. And I, I don't even know why, but I just got up, and I ran to the kitchen sink, and I started throwing up. I started throwing up, dude. And all I remember is her saying, I'm going to throw up. And she just, oh, like, she looks down, and she starts throwing up <laughs> on the floor, dude. And her, remind you? And my mom was like, her mom? everything. <laughs> Her mom was like, oh my god. And then, I felt so bad. And then she was like, she, she only threw up a little her. And then she was like, I have to go to the bathroom. She ran to the bathroom. Out, and I guess she fell asleep on the toilet. <laughs> I did. <laughs> but I was, I was like throwing up and I felt hella dizzy. Like the light was like, like messing with me. Like I was spinning. Um, But I was spinning. Like, my mind was spinning, not me spinning. <laughs> <laughs> and I kept, like, I was so drunk. Nobody even went to go check on her in the bathroom until I said something. I told her mom, I was like, can you please go check on her? Because I felt like I couldn't move. I literally couldn't move from the sink. Like, the light. I was probably having the best I was, sleep. I was, I like, so, I was it. so busy and so nauseous. And the light was fucking me up. I was literally inside of my shirt. Like, I was inside of my shirt. That way it was so dark in there. And they went to go check on you. 
and then they your mom was like she fell asleep on the bathroom and i guess she woke you up and then she you know handled her business she went to the room and just knocked out on the bed she spread it out on the whole entire bed in the middle just laying there me after a while uh her sister and uh somebody else <laughs> her sister and somebody else came to me and was like do you, you need help <laughs> like oh, they did ask me that they were like do you guys want to get drunk and i'm like over here throwing up and shit and i'm over here dizzy and they're over here asking me if i want to get drunk still <laughs> like no party's been started y'all late right um but they were like, I'm like, hey, I don't know. Like, I'm hella fucked up. And they were like, you need help going to the bathroom or something? I was like, hell yeah. As soon as they said bathroom, I was like, hell yeah. I was like, I'm going to go sit my ass in the shower. And I had cold water just hitting me, like, hitting me and hitting me. And eventually, like, I think I was sitting in there for, like, an hour. Dude. Really? In the shower? And, and, and then they came in the bathroom, and they're like, you good, bro? And they, like, helped me, like, get up. Like, they didn't see me. But they stuck their hand in the shower and like reached for my hand and pulled me up because I was on the ground. I was on the ground trying to wake up, but I, I couldn't stand up because I felt like I was going to fall. Dude, and on top of that, we were eating hot Cheetos too. Them hot Cheetos is what came up. Mm -hmm. Don't mess with them hot Cheetos when you're drinking. <laughs> they always come up. But man, I was so messed up that day. The next day, dude. Cause we were drinking Sprite as the chaser. So in the morning when we were having breakfast, we were gonna drink sp Sprite. Oh, we couldn't. We just couldn't. We couldn't eat nothing or drink nothing. We just felt like Pah. And even watching TV, dude, if they were drinking like any type of alcohol, we'd be like- I could smell it. Like up. through the TV, I could literally smell like liquor just because of, we drank too much. And it was a bottle each, that's hella. And it was it was the big bottle. It wasn't yeah. the baby bottle. It was the big bottle. <laughs> we was crazy. Mm -mm. All right. Who are your guys' celebrity crushes? If you don't have one right now, who was it in the past? I don't know her name, but it's the girl from Pretty Little Liars. Liars. It's like the. I think, I think she's like the Barbie Mitchell, no? No. Yeah, her real name? Yeah. Something like that. I think her, her name in the show was Emily. I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm going to be asking her. What's your celebrity? Chris? I'm not one. <laughs> in your past. In my past? Mm-hmm. It was Channing Tatum. Who? Channing Tatum. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Bye. What is the most meaningful tattoo you have? And this one. Why? <laughs> what did it say? <laughs> it says, respect the past, create the future. What does it mean to you? What does it mean to me? Exactly what it says. <laughs> Literally, exactly what it says is what it means to me. Yeah. Because... I feel like you should just respect the past and just leave the past in the past and just move forward and create the future. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, mine is my mazapan. Why? I'm just kidding. Mine is this one because my zodiac. I think it's in the Chinese, Chinese calendar or dragon. Can't see it. Anyways, yeah. That's a sexy tattoo. too. Mine needs a touch up because it didn't, when it healed, some of the ink like rejected, I guess. Yeah. My, you know how they put the white? Mine went, mine, mine is gone. Mm hmm Because of my hand too. Um, when was the last time you got in a fight and what happened to cause it? Y'all really want to know? I fought your sister. I know you do. <laughs> yeah. She's crazy. She's crazy, but you gotta love her, right? 
Yeah. It all started with her arguing with her. And I had just paid for her nails. Like, just paid for a set of nails. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, hell no. Hell no. She is not about to, uh, like, fight her. Because obviously if they fight her nails, might break. You never know. And her yeah. sister was coming for her, like, coming for her, coming for her. She started coming at you, too. But she came for me because I started, like, blocking her, and she slaps me or something. I think she slapped me on my face, and that's what got me so heated. And, like, go. She slammed her into the motherfucking hood of the car. I body slammed <laughs> her into the hood. <laughs> like I was like, go, baby, ass. And I literally was on top of her sister and everything, and and then her, her ex boyfriend. You could say, <laughs> her ex boyfriend uh, pulled me off. Like he like grabbed me from the back, and like I was about to beat his ass too because I was so mad. He was like, "Calm down, calm down, calm down," and I was like, "Let go of me before I beat your ass." <laughs> and as soon as I said that, because obviously he's seen how mad and heated I was. He let me go because I was I was really about it. I was really about to beat his ass. Mm -hmm. I was so mad. Like you can I even ask her. Like I was so mad. <laughs> yeah. Like the whole day. Like even after when we left, I was telling her I want to beat your sister's ass. Like <laughs> I was super mad. But we good now. We cool. We cool now. That's mm -hmm. the bestie. Have you ever gotten into a fight, baby? No, I never been in a fight. They wanted to fight me, but girl, everybody, everybody. Well, I had somebody. Ah, oh, beat their ass. I had someone in middle school. She's like, "Don't call me a bitch because you don't know me." I was like, "It's my daddy." Oh wow. Um, and my sister, plenty of times. Oh my god, her and her sister. Other than that, I never really like gone into drama like that. Oh, with your brother? Oh, and my brother. What's something you like that you don't think most people would like? Oysters. A. I'm with her <laughs> on that one. A, A and mussels. Mussels. And mussels. People. And papaya salad. A lot papaya of people don't salad. like papaya salad. Dude, I remember we made her mom try it. She spit, she it, spit out. it out. I was like, mm -mm. I felt disrespected. Um... For me, I feel like, I don't know. What's something that I ate that you thought I wasn't gonna like? Oh, there's something actually that I like that she don't like. Hmm. It's Pokey Express. It's good. It's really good, but once I eat too much of it, I start to getting, I start getting like sick, and I want to throw it up. Like but, it makes you too full or something too fast. Yeah, and it's a little bit of food. Yeah, <laughs> but it's raw fish, and there's other ones like crab and squid, mm -hmm. all types of things, you know, like seafood with rice. I'll probably put a picture. We'll probably put a picture. Um, the next question is dream vacation. Um, my dream vacation would be either in Dubai, mm -hmm. um, Cancun. My dream vacation is Dubai and Iceland. Deal breakers in a relationship, baby. If you cheat, if you're not honest, um, if you entertain other females, if you entertain other guys. Um, if you make people think that they have a chance with you, um, I think that's it. And you? If you cheat, especially if you do sexual shit, because that's just a no no. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know about, yeah, flirting is cheating, but it depends on what type of flirting, like, like, Say if I found you like texting someone and like fucking like y'all never met ever and y'all fucking texting like like fucking like flirting you know, but.
but y'all never met, like that's something that we'll probably have to talk about. If someone offered you to join the Squid Games, would you and why? <laughs> You know, you win something and no because of, you know, everybody that you have to go through. I don't think you're going to be able to spend that much money just yourself. I feel like everyone should have killed. They should have been like, oh, you're eliminated. But like here, here's like half, you know, like the percentage. Yeah. Okay. Well, what's your answer for the question? Yeah. <laughs> Happen, you know, that's like one in a million. I'll so. join, sign me up right now. Like, whoever created it, I want to I wanna sign it right now. <laughs> Damn, I, I don't care if I die. If I make it, I make it. If I don't, shit. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> you coming too? The hell? Shit. We're gonna be like that couple. We're gonna be that couple that was in the in the show. Hell no! You know how many couples will probably be in there? Oh a lot. <laughs> Imagine having to kill your significant other. Okay, guys. That was it. Okay, bye guys. Have bye guys. Days. Please don't like, take all these answers comment, too serious. Share. And subscribe. Yes, just like she said. Bye. Bye. Adios.